biggest band in the world. It's kind of poppy, right? A little bit, but it's not like stupid. Like all I see is hardcore bands, tight jeans going. Whoa. strives to just play great shows, meet people, and um, you know just build this whole movement that has happened with us over the past three years to a, a place that um, you know we build this reputation where people know that when they come to see us, they're going to get a great show. They're going to get 100% of, of us, and um, they're going to hear some great music. a lot during shows but the person who probably sweats the most I would guess I put my money on Darren Darren sweats profusely on stage Paul smells pretty Paul smells like piss sometimes I don't know, I don't know why man sweating I am disgusting it was a distracting odor well as the through the whole night like my god this is awful what was I'm just uh when we get on when we get on the road, usually about two two weeks into um, into it into the tour is when you get a rhythm going. It usually takes about two minutes. When I step on the bus, I'm exhausted. I already want to get off the bus. It depends on how strenuous the shows the shows are. I guess as far as like how many nights we're playing in a row. But I, I don't I don't know I don't really get tired I'm always tired I just live that way to be honest with you I get maybe at the end I get a little worn out wanting to go sleep in my own bed you know I, I live in a state of exhaustion but I don't get I don't get necessarily um, worn out from traveling a lot of people hate traveling and they just can't stand it I hate touring man but I love it you know. Craziest Mute Math fans reside most probably in one of two places. First, Montreal, Canada. French, man, I'm telling you. They seem like they're reserved, 
but when you get in, get them in a room and start playing some mute bat tunes, they're crazy. They're crazy, man. Probably next, next in line or right up there is um, Fort Lauderdale, South Florida. They're just insane. This is the last night of the tour. Am I Gary King? This band is not confined to certain parameters. Um, you know, as far as the way I look at the band, I just create whatever I think sounds good. And if it's used for the band, it's wonderful. If it's not, it's no big deal. Just for you tonight